All right. So let's a little stroll down memory lane here. We had our tutorial case. We had the Turnabout Sisters with the Charming Butler guy. The Turnabout Samurai. This is when things started getting really good. It was in episode three. Culminating in the case of the century where we exonerated our mortal law enemy, Lanumi, Miles Edgeworth. And I, here I thought after completing this, we were done. But then lo and behold, and it appears in episode five. Well, childhood friend, yes. Slash law enemy. Same thing. I, okay, what's happening on this, this teaser image, by the way? These all look to be new characters. Oh, that's the, the the shady uh, puppet. Isn't that the police mascot that I don't remember the name of? Very exciting. So it looks like we're gonna deal with some kind of military uh, high-ranking lady. And, and I don't know what the the thing in between the mascot and the uh, general lady is. A stage of some sort. I don't know. Frager, you are just in the city of Phoenix recently. Well, this is just too good timing. All right. Well, I, I don't think there's any reason to to delay. Let's, let's get started. Start. Let's do it. I did see this at the end of the last case, and then I stopped. But it's helpful to have a refresh because it's been a bit. You guys might be able to, might be about to witness a crime, by the way. Okay, so I don't know if this is like a stylistic choice or if this is implying that two murders happened at the same time in two different buildings by like identical twi twins or something. Oh dear. Yeah, very 007 kind of opening. That's yeah, bam. Am I left? Okay, so two months after the Edgeworth case. So Phoenix's phone has had to be ringing off the hook by now. That had to make shockwaves in the press, I, I have to assume. That was a big deal, that Edgeworth game. Or, or he's down in the dumps instead. Oh, well, what? Don't you need to get paid? Is Maya being replaced? Where did Maya go? Does she need to do more like medium training? Well, not much has changed in two months. <laughs> God, are you okay, man? You might need to see a therapist. Oh. Shouldn't that case have ignited your lawyerly defense passions? You're on like a four case win streak. I mean, it's just really sad that his assistant left. His assistant friend. Like, oh. I didn't skip any, like, narrative stuff here. That is all happening so fast. Okay, good. Good question. Thank you. Phoenix audience surrogate. Well, I'm not going to call you triple question mark. Name would be helpful. <laughs> okay, I re I'm now noticing this this pin she is wearing. <laughs> I don't, well, the three pins really, but I like the incredibly shocked face pin a lot. In fact, I can't stop staring at it now. What are the blue pins under? What are, are those like la like LMAO faces? about to say with us. Very poggers pens, yeah. 
He does look like Gunk. Okay, this lady's like got a heavy science vibe here. Famous. Oh, explains where that emote comes from now that I'm singing chat. Like fail the earlier cases and the, you like run out of life meter, you're still considered undefeated in the Phoenix Wright canon, so that's good to know. That makes me feel better about potential future failures. Hey, a four law win streak, it's very impressive. I don't blame him. He's probably got anxiety about taking another case because he's worried about getting that first L. Flashback to better times. Her mood swings are concerning. Hello, Emma. Emma, Mia, Maya. There's too many names that are short and end in A. I'm going to mix them up inevitably. Tell me about this scientific, I mean, tell me about yourself. So not a scientist, but scientific invest. So she likes, runs the DNA. I really, I would wear this pen if I had it for sure. It's, what is it meant to represent though? Is it like an investigator achievement? Like she solved a world, she had a world record case solve time and everyone was shocked about it. That's very young to be a sci an official scientific investigator. Impressive, though. Child genius! Mm. Oh, they just plan your life out, like, in advance in uh, Japan, California. Puka, thank you for the 80 months. It is? Why have I never heard of you, then? So what, so what are we doing? Who are we defending? What's happening? There's, there's a trial tomorrow that we have to prepare for. A knife. Hey, that happened in the intro. Wait, what? That sounds bad. That's, that's conjecture. It's not science at all. You're terrible at your job. Pretty similar as a distant family. But no, she already is one, kind of. Sorry. What, that's... Is it that odd? That's a reasonable career aspiration, I feel. <laughs> Very bold claim. <laughs> Very brave stance, Emma Sagan. I mean, we can bring her Mia, just she might be a little let down 
at the meeting. I have to wear a clothes pin. So scientifically, a witness saw her kill someone. <laughs> That's this is already pretty bad from a science perspective. Unless the witness is bad. Scientific. Does it involve pins? And swag bow ties, by the way. That's impressive bow tie she has. I think we need more scientists need to wear that. Or is this snapping Phoenix out of his post case four funk depression? Oh yeah. What's the relation? Didn't news like go out? widely about her death? Or are they visiting from far away? You expect people reading? That's a fair point. Yeah. Too busy doing the science. Too busy doing the news. Is a, kind of has a feminine look about him. It's fine. Understandable mistake. It's about to get sad in here. Ooh. Oh, well, so it's good that she's going to prison. More parent death. Here we go. Nope. Why are you smiling about it, though? That's rather unsettling. My parents died in a car accident. Is there any uh, new stuff to any new observations in case five here? It's kind of a strange look. What, what was that? They're still difficult. <laughs> and yet, I have a four case win streak. God. Oh, Phoenix. Oh, how's, uh, how's what's his name? Bellhop guy. Oh, hotel's taken off. We got a chain happening. Oh yeah, bellboy. Yeah. <laughs> he gets. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah, let's do what she asked. Sounds. Hey, what's up, guard guy? Your sister's here, right? Could it have something to do with the fact that her sister is about to be tried for murder? Could that explain her down mood? Hey, he talks. Is, is this the, it's been a while. Is this the first time he's actually said something, the guard? How, how's that related? Why does she, why is she in charge of his performance review? That is a chair behind her, in front of her, right? She's trying to do a cool thing, but it's kind of odd with the chair position like that. She's doing the cool camp counselor sit down. It's so weird they didn't assign you a public defender yet. Oh, hello. 
Oh, hi, I didn't see you there. So, hey, don't worry. Hey. Mm, that could mean a lot of things. Like, generaling, captaining, what's, what's the rank here? I don't recognize the pens in this universe. I, I thought you were like military or something. Okay. They take they take prosecution very seriously. Guard lights. Uh, Super Zero, thanks for the resub. Forty-eight after these four years. Wow, I can't wow. believe it's time to rise from the ashes already. Right. Wow. Can't be a coincidence. Okay, is there any female character whose name does not end in an A in this universe? A oh, penny, yeah, that, oh yeah. There's also uh, old, yeah, old bag. I was about to say old hag, but yeah, old bag is the right, yeah. Official name. Okay, there are some, there just seems like a lot. What the hell is going on? Yeah, clear it up. <laughs> Guys, get ready for an awesome reveal. <gasps> ah! Well, that was a short case. I guess we're done. That was the Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney game. Uh, solved it. Easy. That was probably the easiest case so far. Oh, hang on. Time to write down details for my investigation. Okay, 515 is when she claims the crime occurred. So on the dot. So hey, maybe this means evidence will reveal that the crime took place at a different time. Although I, that doesn't explain why she's confessing. Oh yeah, the witness. I don't think that's how I would describe it, Phoenix. It's a little underselling it. Okay, so this is the courthouse slash detention. No, there's are separate places. Okay. okay. <laughs> Classy place to steal a court. Here, then. Who'd you murder? Oh. Gumshoe? Uh, BSC be calling. Thanks for the 24 months. Happy two years. I can't I believe Gumshoe is dead. Terrible twos. Oh. Congratulations. Stabbed in the tummy. That sounds important. Stabbed in tum tum. I'm gonna write down. Short for tummy, tum tum, even though that's more letters. Why'd you do it? Yeah. That they need to hire a new detective. <laughs> yeah, what, what does it mean? Right. Buy 
Bye then, I'm leaving. Now <laughs> tell me about yourself. I was. Including this one. I will be prosecuting myself. Chiefly. If you manage every aspect, then what do the actual prosecutors do? Right? Uh, your point taken. This never came up in the prior case. Probably not relevant. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Emma. I was wondering that too. I'm trying to visualize the mechanics of that, but okay. about the weather. Communicating with the dead and all that, you know. She could bench press 400. No, not like that, Phoenix. At killing. There's more important stuff going on here. Phoenix, stop getting offended by everything. Yeah, that's a problem. Sad. Very selfish doing all that murder crime. Oh. Oh, Kikoshkia, thank you for the raid. Hello, everyone. We have just started case five of Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. Welcome, everyone. It's my first time playing through the Ceres. Okay, that is pretty selfish when she frames it like that. That is fair. Things are going well. Hope you're doing well, too. Hope you had a good stream. Well, this doesn't sour the mood for you new folks too much. It's getting pretty depressing in here. Oh. <laughs> okay. Silent treatment, then. Please leave fast. It's very uncomfortable to stand like this in front of the chair. Is that a wink wink? Why 
are you doing it in such a roundabout way? And she does have really nice hair. That's a good call out, yeah. Oh, you're right. Present the badge. I should have done that. Maybe she doesn't believe I'm an actual attorney. It's one of the five faces Emma has. Got to me. Attaboy, Phoenix. He's got the lawyerly drive back. What, murdering and stuff? <laughs> Twice in a row, no less. With, again, the murder. <laughs> Maybe job stress? Like, that could have that effect. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? You ever get so stressed, that, you know? Oh my God, we have to go beyond science. I don't think Emma's cut out for this then. Let's shell. All right. Is this impressive? Okay, I guess it is impressive. <laughs> he's, he's right. It is? What? Oh. Phoenix, take care of your badge. It's supposed to be the pride of your career. Dude. That was like instant science. Impressive. <laughs> you know what? I'll take that, actually. That sounds like a good deal. This thing has not been that useful. I lose this case, then we'll talk. Hopefully that doesn't devalue it. Okay. <laughs> to the crime s I mean, to the crime scene. Hmm. Okay, this new location looks a, a smidge fancier than what I recall from the other places. A little more detail, maybe a little more color to it. Maybe it's just me. I don't know. Hmm. Just doing a quick sweep of this. A lot of stuff here. Is this a parking lot? They are? I mean, put that tipped over uh, drum back, too. It's not bad. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I see a ladder in the background. It was the whole ladder thing, was that limited to that, that meme thing? Was that limited to that one case or is it, is it a continuing thing? Let's find out. Hey. <laughs> May as well start irritating them now. We're breaking the law, scientifically. <laughs> I'm trying not to stand out too much here, see? Oh, gumshoe? Wait. Okay, that's not gumshoe. I don't know who this is, but I like his thing. <laughs> yes, hello, Revolver Ocelot. Are you a cosplayer or are you an investigator? He's, he's dedicated to this gimmick. <laughs> his name is Marshall. Or no, he is a Marshall. 
I've never tried this shaving technique. Anybody recommend? <laughs> the classic sheriff look. <laughs> Finish my gang's gold track, see, partner. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's not a real gun. That's that's definitely not okay. <laughs> oh hey, there's a we're covering up uh, something. A badge or something. I kind of like the guy's attitude though. Drink on the job. Who gives a crap? You know. He is. Well, they did just lose a detective, so maybe they were desperate and just found the first person. Okay. Do the ladder first. Ugh. Okay. Delightful, a ladder. Oh my god. Okay. Shouldn't you know, Emma? It's a whole thing. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. It's, it's not that amazing, Emma. It's a door. It could mean there's a room beyond that. Yeah, it's just a step door. <gasps> Mysterious lock. Well, how are people supposed to get to the office from the parking lot then if they lock the door? Or is that the door to the the, the kitty area that's up there? Okay, she's gonna do this with everything we look at. Okay, she's not doing too well at the scientific parts of this investigation what with contaminating the scene. Oh, that's actually a potentially important detail. So it's a water drum. the floor wet? Well, the crime's already happened. I mean. <laughs> Debatable. Okay, so the drum is spilled over, apparently not filled with water at the time. Uh, oh, what's this? We can't possibly get past this. Oh, the wall is filled with water. Fascinating. Science. Wallet, not a bag. Yeah, Phoenix, you normally look at stuff yourself first before calling the police. Kind of weird that they didn't already grab it, but whatever. Okay, I should be writing this down too. She's teaching a lot. <laughs> 
Uh, I can't argue with this. She's right. <laughs> now just roll with it, man. It's cool. Might be money in it. Okay. Mm -hmm. There, oh, there's seat. We'll open it. Okay, how do I look at something I picked up? Right. Oh, this is actually new, I think. Oh, this wallet is huge. It's as big as your face. Uh, oh, um. Oh, these keys are weird. <laughs> okay. How do I drag the the uh, cursor to where I want to get? Oh. Uh, oh, okay. You just use the mouse and click it around. That's easier. Oh, that's right. Yeah, touch screen game. Yeah, this makes sense then. Yeah. Originally. Okay. Enter. Hit enter. I don't have to do this too much. This is a little awkward. It's a very fuzzy ID card. What does that say? Sergeant? Something, something, please. Nice tie. Nice tie. Very dapper fellow here. Is this the, the Vic? ID card. His sergeant. Bruce Deadman. Heavy science here. Okay. It's it's bugging me that police department is the only unfuzzy part of that, but I, I gotta let that go. And the picture up. That's what I've been doing, him. This this gal's good. She knows everything. of the science here. I'm like, come on. Well, how wide is the entrance? Is there an opposition arrow, perhaps? <laughs> it's a few feet away. I've seen this sort of technology. Enthusiasm is infectious. I'll give her that. Okay. We go oh, we have a slide option here. I'm now seeing. So is there more? Wow. Hey, let me go back here. Okay. Tiny little parking lot. We have <laughs> this car's trapped. The one up here. Hey. This A is the crux of our investigation. <laughs> Did you think I left or something? He's gonna stab himself. It's repetition like that. And he's had not at all touching the other side of his face. Oh, he's one of those kinds of sheriffs. Which, which one? <laughs> Presumably the one with all the tape around it. I'm more interested in who owns the car that seems to be trapped in this this hell attic up here. Is the body still there? Cannot read that. 
just so <laughs> Good old 12th floor saloon. No, I meant you're not too young for survey, so I'm sorry. Okay, oh, it's a lead, I guess. Oh, are we going there now? Oh, we're here. I'd ask you to leave, but that would make sense. that. Wait, another per Who's this? Uh, who? I mean, lunch does sound pretty good. What is that hat? <laughs> oh, hey, thanks. Happened? What's, what do the two halves? Corn and beans? Oh, it's free? Okay. Okay, that actually looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. I will take that. Thank you. Yeah, just giving us the box for the lunch for free. I'm not going to ask. Is it related to her products that she sells? Yeah, cough up as in like, you know, give me the, the info. Give it up. Cough it up. Her boxes keep regenerating in her bag, too. It's impressive. Oh. <gasps> know something, then. What? Yeah, that's that's still... That's kind of the elephant in the room there. Hmm. Uh, so she is doing the coughing up of witnessing and tattletelling. I feel like her first name is going to be a bit of a misnomer. Hmm. <laughs> Phoenix is into this. Salmon does sound really good right now, though. This case is going to make me hungry. Yesterday was pie day. Chief Prosecutor. What? 
Is that true? What about the queen of prosecutors? The chief prosecutor's lady. Come on. <laughs> you know how they have those. Now, we're definitely not the king of defenders. We only have four cases under our belt so far. Need more for that. Well, that would be a crime, Angel. Do you understand? That sounds it. Yes, back to the science, please. What is, what is an evil lunch? When's the last time you guys had an evil lunch? Yeah, same. Mm hmm. Okay. Angel. I'm going to write some stuff down here. Angel. Lunch. Grudge. For my own mind. Uh, yeah, yeah, what'd you see? Let's get to brass tacks here. Just how ironclad is this witnessing? Fascinating spectacle, murder. No, I have bejesum for my prior notes that I will be sure to reference for this case as well. <clears throat> I'm more frightened of your wrath than, uh, than Lana. So her knife did the crime, not her. Sounds like you think it was awesome. A moment. Like the stabby stabby? Oh. Yeah, she's into it. So, so this is the evil lunch you're offering me? It looks like a lot. What does that say? Fresh? Just fresh? Hey, it's just fresh. I don't care what it is. It's fresh. I'm in. prosecutor's office. You only serve prosecutors who you don't like. I mean, they're apparently free as well, so I can understand that. Yeah, she does indeed sell the evil lunches, it sounds like. Lunch, heaven forbid. Just give it to me. I hope that's cooked, but yeah. Mm. I'll give, it a, give it a chance. Wait, do I have this now? <laughs> This part of my uh, court record? Okay, it's not. <laughs> It'd be funny if these were relevant to the case somehow. Maybe they will be. Have you ever thought about selling in other places though? Like expand your horizons a bit? 
security. Uh, security, that's what that probably says up there. Not, not kitty. Like, like with one T. Okay. What's that? Secure kitty. I mean, I can't see it from here, literally, but I'm gonna trust you. Well, that's sweet, I guess. <laughs> Nothing's more important than. Yeah, sum it up for me. <laughs> That's a good summary, actually. That's good science. I like it. <laughs> Damn. I'm glad that's a parenthetical if you didn't hear it. Yeah, yeah, let's expand on this. Like, physically? No. Alright, I lost some appetite. <laughs> Good analysis. <laughs> Don't call her that, Emma. Just call her Angel. What could possibly make you think there's more? I, I guess we're done. Okay, do I... Can I investigate the place I got in trouble for? Can I slide? It doesn't look like I can. Oh, wait. wait. No. I want to see if I can get back over there. Hmm. guess I can't. Oh, wait, examine. There we go. No. Oh, we're stuck. I can't move. I want to check out the car. All right. I guess we have to take the lead we were offered then and go to, if I can hit the correct button once, go to. All right. Maybe she'll be impressed by this. I mean, no, not... Oh. Oh, pickle? Uh, I don't really like pickles. That's that's way too many pickles also for you to eat at once. I don't think so. Yeah, <laughs> yeah all right. Okay. This, this lady's mo it's frightening me a little bit. Let's, let's go somewhere else. I'm okay with like a couple of pickles, but an entire box of pickles for a meal? Hey, Steel Samurai. A way to, oh. Oh, that outfit. Recognize that anywhere. It's really likes his clothes. This is such a frou-frou office. What an odd game of ch chess happening over here. Checkers chess. <laughs> okay. Oh, he's <laughs> that's the King of Prosecutors trophy? Is it... I, I guess it looks like part of it's torn off? The top? It's supposed to be a shield? Trophy! Why would they have a shield for prosecutors, though? That's not what they do. <laughs> uh-huh. Oh, my God. He's back. Oh, it's definitely him. <gasps> What's up, man? Okay, the outfit you have the drawing of, the painting of is, is slightly different, actually. 
Maybe that's what he wore when he accepted his king trophy. Oh boy. Instant charm. It's a callback I won't get it this time. Okay. You say so. Oh, I see, because this came out post the third game in the series. Okay, so Edgeworth gets, like, armor upgrades throughout the course of the games, then. <laughs> At least he's self-aware. Oh, didn't they say the car and the trophy, same per Oh, that's his car? <laughs> hey, a new Edgeworth face unlocked, I think. I don't think I've seen that look before. Edgeworth, heck, can you, like, not be adjacent to crime? Once. Go, 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 go. Blood curdling screen. Did we did we establish Edgeworth was a steel samurai fan? That that did come up right in a prior case. I feel like he mentioned it. Uh, let me look around here first before we talk. get out of the way. I want to nose around. What the heck? Okay. Take a lot of pride in it, I see. Dumping it on the sofa. As determined by what? Like you recently, you almost went to jail recently. Just a fan voted poll. All those prosecutor fans out there. <laughs> I mean, the design doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Like, I'm just putting a big K on it is the best they could come up with. <laughs> so wait, so they give this out monthly? Oh, well, I'll just take it. It's fine. Is this relevant to the investigation somehow? I mean, it is broken, it would seem. Right, like, tell me about this. If I click on this, will I get Ace Attorney 3 spoilers? Man, am I going to have to play the whole trilogy now? Probably. He probably won't care. Yeah, who gave you that, Edgy, huh? Ooh, what's it say? Uh, wait, who was Wendy again? It's been a long time. Right, old bag's name was Wendy. Yes, thank you. That's right. I forgot she had a real name. Oh, that's right. She was like super obsessed. Yeah, yeah. Together. Mm. It's pretty tight. I 
can see Gumshoe as well in the desk. Strange. Strange. <laughs> For theft. Like the pettiest of theft. Unless the elevator's out. Well, how many floors is this place? Great! If the victim fell by falling, that would be useful. Yeah, you would. I mean, I do that as well. Fancy, fancy, fancy. Wow. Okay, now I'm. Th I was hungry with the lunches. Now I'm thirsty. Oh, but I have a drink here. It's not tea, though. <laughs> your your tea hobby's getting out of hand, bro. Okay, how challenging are these books? Oh, file. Definitely not a step ladder. No. Oh. Because they're besties. talking to Edgeworth, I need to snoop around first. It's the right order to do things. It's science. So it is chess. <laughs> so does blue, is that is even a king? Like, I don't, how does this game work? Looks more like a pawn and all the other pieces are gone. getting off the case a little bit now. No, it's not. It's round. Are we going to see Gumshoe again? They play chess together? That'd be so cute. you know. Yeah, but that's, yeah, that's legit though. I believe that. Where's, where's this going? Okay. To fanfic.net! How do you guys feel about Sofa here? Where do we stand on this? Right, is that everything? Looks like it is. All right, let's let's get to chatting. Oh. <laughs> I just helped exonerate you. Well, d two months ago. Last year. What is that? <laughs> you just said. Thank you. 
yeah. Wait, isn't that like a conflict of interest situation there? Did she present the King of Prosecutors trophy to you? The case is clearly tainted, if so. No one else is available, so. That's true. We did just lose Von Karma as well. And tell me about yourself, Edward. You're welcome. Ooh. You got some hot goss? No? I've been in a very deep depression for two months, Edgeworth. Apparently. Oh. <laughs> Murder. It's not a wholly unreasonable circumstance in the past. It's not that crazy. Very, very profound, Edgeworth. Very true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why are you so smug about it, then? Oh, was Edward like playing with it and he broke it by accident? That sounds pretty cute. More sheepish. Looks kind of smuggish to me. It's a, it's a punchable face. He tried to harm a steel samurai with a shield. It's way too big for the steel samurai. Strange face to go with this. I wanted to just have someone in the trunk of my car. Mm -hmm. Oh, what? <laughs> did they, did I gloss over that from earlier? What? Your knife, your car, this, this is a bad look, man. I have a toolbox. It didn't come with a knife, though. Usually. No pr Okay. These little details on the evidence descriptions are important. No prance. Let's write that down. On weapon. Okay. <laughs> Funny joke, Phoenix. Hilarious. <laughs> yeah. You're kind of messed up, Phoenix. Uh, I guess we're complete here after pissing Edgeworth off. Let's get out of here. Oh, wait. Uh, uh, tell me more about your trophy. Despite being on trial. Whoa. Mm. 
I do like that he hates it. Oh, it is already broken? <laughs> I haven't seen him yet. Odd. They replaced him with the sheriff guy. I prefer gumshoe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First, we'll gotta show him. Remember when I defended you? Mm. Yes, I remember this. Actually, I feel like I shouldn't show him the badge thing or the uh, ID since he's, you know, the prosecution and everything. Well, yeah, exactly. Fine. I won't show you what I got then. God. It's complicated, Emma. He's just a dick, you know? Think about this. I, did. I, mean, I just saw some hot tea. She's looking directly at me. I'm just drinking the tea in the park. Yeah, T technology was so complex. T technology. Uh, I have this knife now. messes me up how sometimes you only get one place to go, then you move to the next place, then more places open up. Uh, back here then, I guess. Let's review what we've learned. Oh, she's not here. <laughs> Never mind. How you doing, buddy? Right. All right, still giving us the silent treatment then. Let's review what we've learned. No. Um, what do you think about this? Can I get to the police department? Hmm? Okay, did I miss like an crucial detail dialogue? Oh, okay. That's right. When we showed him the thing, it implied there was a new dialogue option. <laughs> they clean the offices once a year. Sounds shady. Are you 
just love rewarding yourselves, don't you? The pre-broken shield. Oh. Oh, wait, okay, so 512. So murder happened three minutes later. So we got there. I guess three minutes is enough time to get away before shit goes down. doesn't strike me as the science-y type. I don't know. Yeah, Gumshoe does deserve an award. That's fair. <laughs> well, you did that whole, have whole that, you did have that whole, you know, traumatic childhood experience thing. Can understand the memory lapses. Oh my god, these military time. <laughs> Terrible. Well, he's both. Okay. Probably relevant for later. Do we know for a fact that, well, that's what, so Lana told us it happened at that time, but she's like an unreliable narrator for this. So do we have, where's autopsy report? Where is it? Office is, what the hell? What happened to your hand? What what are you? This is not a human person, right? <laughs> You're way too calm for this. This guy's freaking me out. Uh oh, oh autopsy report? <laughs> you got handcuffs dangling around your <laughs> This guy's a mess. Rope hanging around his arms. I don't know what this means. Or... I think that officer did it. She's something, something not right about him. Okay, now, okay. Mannequin or purse? Of slapping going on. I'm glad he's not using his bullhorn. Uh. <laughs> right, man. Skipped what he said there. I didn't even click anything. Meekins. <laughs> Please get out. Oh. Okay, now I feel kind of bad for him. His nose is leaking and everything. Hey, what's he holding there? Oh, Meekins. Oh, he's, he's a ghost as well. That explains things. I see. Yeah, I'm, I'm ready to get out of here. Hmm. Okay, there's our... Detective Patrol. I get there from here. There we go. The entrance? We've been inside before. <laughs> I guess in the couple months since case four, the uh, uh, blue uh, badger? Blue badger? 
took off. Really going all in on this thing. Well, it looks kind of shitty. Who's running in pain at the police department? Have you been here before? You're not even riding your bike anymore, man. Got to get that exercise. 30 minutes with no traffic? Jeez. How big is this city? <laughs> Please don't have a... Oh, God. Music does not help. Blue Patcher loves you. Blue Patcher is friends with children. <laughs> the power of the Nintendo DS. Like really, really trying. It was the chief of this place that made it, right? Not Gumshoe. Because, yeah, I remember he was, when we talked to him in prior cases, he had a lot of pride about this thing. Wait, this, well, that's Emma, Phoenix. Gumshoe! He's back! I was worried this was going to be a gumshoeless case! Gumshoe! <laughs> Why are you dancing with your mask? <laughs> like in broad daylight in public, no less. Your little shaving scar still hasn't healed, huh? Slow day, huh? Busy trying out my moves. Right. Hang on. We'll get to you in a minute. Who's, whose campaign is happening? Oh, it's a, more of an effort than not an election. So you can sentence them to death. No, Emma, why? <laughs> Known crime solvers, pandas. Shoplifting. That's, that's not striped. What y'all talking about? For a very long time. <laughs> that's, 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 that's the thing they do. develop a thriving friendship. How can you tell? I don't even see anybody. All right, let's examine this monstrosity. <laughs> I 
Oh, you made... It all makes sense now, though. <laughs> Did your thing. <laughs> this cost our entire department's budget for the year. Incredible. I prefer the inflatable tube men myself. <laughs> no, I don't want it. Uh. This is going to solve the crime, though. It's a good thing we have it. <laughs> you need to present that to like, everyone I talk to. And it's the blue badger space. Wow. Well, also the papers are blank. That could explain it. Oh, we got police. Well, that's weird. What percentage of movies are based in a police station? How many samurai episodes, steel samurai episodes, have been devoted to police station settings? If you need a bottle episode or something, budgets are strained. Not a bad setting, though. Oh, no, we just listened to them. No, <laughs> you're both wrong. All right, Gumshoe. Oh, he's so sad that we ignored him for so long. Poor guy. Oh, I feel so bad. All right. This is our sister, Gumshoe. Come on. That is an issue. We're, we're working on it, though. Okay, that's a pretty specific confession. That raises many other questions, Emma. We have evidence. That's, that's never happened, Emma. We, we're doing that. I don't have the slide option, Gumshoe. You have to talk here. heart rate exponentially God. blue badger might hear you I think it'd be cool if every time Gumshoe faded out, there was a different facial expression on Blue Badger, or like he gets slowly closer to you. It'd be a good effect. Probably have to change the game rating to M, though. Just dancing. Serious. Wait, the sheriff guy is like a chief 
dude. Chief Sheriff. I guess Sheriff is his own thing. Marshall. Not confusing at all. Wait, his name is Marshall? Oh, yeah, because he was a sheriff. And the, okay. Right. I'm in. Ugh, names. And then it turns out his middle name is U.S. It gets even more confusing. Leave him angry like this. Yeah, he shot so much. Um. Uh, <laughs> well, why not? <laughs> but you made it. I presented the right thing, right? <laughs> That's not true. I haven't done that ever. Oh, it's a badge off. Well, you have the shock face badge. That's even better, in my opinion. This needs to be the future of ID cards or badges like this. Oh, I should probably show them. Nice little subtle hint there. I can't read it. Detective right, please. Oh. But you're just a rank and file. He's too exhausted from his dancings. Memory's a little slow. Can you, oh, it's probably a new dialogue prompt. Uh, what do you think about this? Yeah, did you break it? Did you make it? You're pretty handy. It's like when you break champagne on a ship before it sails out. Do that with like new police cars. like a normal bloodstained knife. How symmetrical is this blood spatter on both sides, though? The same? Not quite. No, it's not. Where the ticket stuff fly? D. 
indeed. Uh, oh yeah, new dialogue prompt potentially? Yes. Maybe we're just that good of investigators with all the science and whatnot. Was he going to get the King of Detectives award and perhaps there was a jealous other detective? Sounds irrelevant. So potentially some evidence that someone didn't want transfer -ailed. Remember, like, two months ago, very recent. How salacious are we talking? Give me the hot goss. Now oh, we've heard all that already. Turn a phrase there, Phoenix. <gasps> but he's already the king. That sounds like a demotion. Going from a king to a chief prosecutor? He's going to need a new trophy and everything. How are they going to design a C? okay with it. That's all gun metaphors with these people. Oh, okay. No, it means we're not going to see you in court and get to see you sweat under questionings. Oh, we already established that thing. name is Jake. It's just Jake. It's the most normal name I've come across in this whole series. For being from LA, that does explain it, though. Hmm? What's crossed out there? $20 for what? The bearer of the letter of introduction. Okay, so that gives us the authority to slide in the parking lot. Excellent. It unlocks the Q button, Phoenix. It's important. must be really strange if they have to recycle their manila envelope. 20 bucks. Oh. Oof. 
Big 20. Couldn't get a 300 drop there. Anything else? Doesn't look like it. What about the paper? Burning a lot of time. I don't think I don't feel ready for court at all. Wait, who's another new person? Oh. Wait, who are you talking to? Oh yeah, she has a boyfriend who works here. Sounds like their relationship's eating up, though. Oh, oh, oh. Um, okay. Yeah. Are, are they both aware of this? I, oh, she's also a ghost. Uh, th well, actually, what do you think of this? <laughs> oh boy, I Wait, I thought you were from LA. That's that's a good tip. All right, let me in. Twenty dollars annual bonus. That's what it says. Yeah, Texas native LA transplant, the classic. How much was a count? Oh. <laughs> oh God. We're gonna be drowning in bureaucracy, aren't we? This proves it's written by an idiot. You may now slide. Oh, yeah. You've just been scienced, Marshall. I have to replace you with Raylan Gibbons. Okay, now a hoot nanny. I'm in for that. Let's do it. I love me a good hoot nanny. Yeah, we gotta manifest destiny our way over to the new evidence. We need to expand our investigation. Maybe there's twenty dollars in there. Maybe. Just toss it on the floor of the parking lot? It's wasteful. Jerk. Okay, I don't really want to show this guy anything. He's kind of weird. All right. To the evidence! See, I did not examine any of this, right? No. I got to the A before I got interrupted. I see a phone there. Okay, let's be thorough. A block. <laughs> Prosecutor parking only. Well, that's, that's kind of mean. The b block Clear hierarchy going on here. <laughs> it's kind of weird. But you're not aspiring to be a prosecutor or a defense attorney, so where do you park? They somehow have not found yet. It, uh huh? Okay. 
Maybe it's Edgeworth's. No. Let's <laughs> forget about the important phone clue. Yeah, for uh, 20, what, 16? No, now we're in 2017, I think. Kind of outdated model. Oh, let's check it out. Oh, it's... Someone's controlling my... Okay. <laughs> okay. Maybe some people like function over form. No, yeah, it's fine. It's not a steel samurai strap, though, so I'm not impressed. They are. No, oh, Pig Princess is a steel samurai thing. That's right. Huh. Okay, her phone is awesome. Shit. That's the spinoff, right? I want to open it. Why open the phone? power button. Also important. Oh, that's the flip button. Okay. You couldn't just like... You know. It is? It's powered off to me. You can do that? This changes everything. Wow. She really knows her stuff about phones. The giant blue button only does that. <laughs> that's, that's way too big for it to only do that. It's an odd design. If you only use your phone to call back whoever called you last, then it's very good. Sorry, many buttons on this one has arrows, an email icon, and an icon that does something mysterious. <laughs> Even I know this redial technology. Wait till they hear about call logs on the phone. You guys know you can get not only who recently called you, but you can go back like at least five calls in your history. I just found that out. Zoomers, right? I can't believe Phoenix Wright is in fact a phone boomer. <laughs> this is somewhat awkward. Right. The classic kitty retail icon. Forgot how like unpleasantly loud the beeps in this game can be. Have I heard this in prior cases? Is this a callback? Oh, the steel samurai thing. That's oh yeah yeah yeah. Oh, I, I should have just kept going. Yeah. Sounds like a hootenanny's happening over here. Not on my watch. Play that tune again. It was all. That's against the law. How bad are you at your job, Officer Marshall? Oh, so you already investigated and just put it back? Maybe next time just check the call log, but then you wouldn't get to hear the Steel Samurai theme. There's, you know, pros and cons to this thing. Let's 
So she's also a Steel Samurai fan. Everybody loves it. No one answered the phone when we did the redial. During? Guess what I'm doing? Oh, what? Yeah. Her, her sister has a boring strap. She is not in the Pink Princess Club. A few seconds. Well, you, yank, you yoinked her away before she could do anything. Was the recipient phone what we were hearing? Not the... Oh, that makes more sense, yeah. But the white phone. Oh, well... <laughs> you don't even know it's your own phone ringing, Phoenix. I would yell at you to set your phone to vibrate so you'd notice, but then again, we wouldn't hear the Steel Samurai theme, so no. <laughs> yeah, he's not used to getting calls, true. Why but this is getting weird. Has Phoenix not connected the <laughs> that's, that's true. <laughs> anyway. Okay, 518. That's three minutes after. Okay. These, these times all sound important. I'm gonna write 5, 12, 15, and 18. No, wait. Yeah, Edgeworth arrived at 512. Murder happened at 515. Call made at 518. Three minute increments. Very important. So, why? Why would she call Phoenix after the murder and then not want his representation? Mystery afoot. I'm still curious about this car up here, how it got here. Or how, well, I can understand how it got here if it's like, you know, moves. Then how one of the blue card like works a long night or something. This guy's just screwed. All right, was the body here? Official Goodman stationery as well. Okay, I don't know how dates are structured in this universe. I don't know if it's like December 2nd or a complex division problem. Oh, that's an S, not a 5. Okay. Hmm. I can't solve for S based on this information. was severed in half by the trunk. Very sharp trunk, though. Looks like it could work. All right, let's judge Ed Edgeworth's vehicle. Thank you. 
accurate. Is it that much of a luck trick? Or get another look at it. Edgeworth is pretty loaded. Did you see that T set? It's kind of like a normal car, though. Huh? Seems fine. Uh, more coin F four F. Thank you for the raid. Hello. The block is this way. Wait, the visitors and the defense attorneys have to park in the block. They do not think highly of the defense. Don't think about it too much. Yeah, exactly. All right, so we got the phone. Anything else? Missed in this area. I think so. Apparently this ATM or pay to leave thing is not relevant. a good man, that good man. Asking relevant questions, you so fasty. <laughs> yeah, he's from Austin. He's got that hipstery sheriff look about him. Oh, the, uh, right, yeah. I'm jealous it was so good, that bird. Ah, finally. Oh, died within an hour and a half of 4 p.m. So yeah, that one's up. One, not, okay. This all sounds important. One stab. And the window makes sense with the second. Although Bambina does also end in it. Oh. Well, what's the motive then? Yeah, one of them's dead, the other's alive. They got nothing in common. Oh. Well, they, so they do have something in common. Marshall. Step back. Ouch. He just died, man. They're going to etch that on his tombstone. Chief Prospect. <laughs> and we saw that introduction as well where two of her killed someone. Mm. A knife out. <laughs> Always go back to this. Look, we're in Japanifornia. Very far from Texas, I think. What 
called Faking It Till You Make It, Bambina. And yet you keep Gumshoe out and have this guy. Well, the dancing with Blue Badger could qualify as important if you ask him to shoot that. <laughs> when you call him that, it just makes me feel for him with his little dopey face here. Poor Gumshoe gets a bad rap. Playing chess together and having tea parties and everything, right? that down sounds this stinks of corruption somewhere in the prosecutor's office my handwriting's so awful corruption soften up his prosecuting, though, because we did save his ass. Hmm. Is it time for a theme change? Hmm. How many layers does this go? These relationships. Unravel. <laughs> What's it like working here? What do you think he's drinking? Whatever it is, I want some. It would explain his behavior. That's why he's favored in the Super Bowl of Prosecutors, which is another thing they do, aside from the King thing. Uh-oh. Depends. Oh, you're talking about Blue Badger, right? <laughs> Bang. <laughs> what? Okay, you're kind of losing the metaphor here, man. Or is it one of those like guns the little flag comes out and it's like clearance sale on it? <laughs> Six deals more than enough to sell to anything that moves. Mm. 
starting to unravel a pretty good conspiracy here. I guess. It's all we need. As long as it's the current one. I mean, there's the whole your sister confessed thing. As long so like, how do we deal with her pleading guilty at the beginning of this? It feels like a problem. You're right. There's that small issue. <laughs> what? No, it is, though. Oh. Well, with that ironclad testimony, let's go to court. Yeah. I mean, we all do now. Wait, that was your phone, Phoenix. I thought. What? Right? Oh, I need to advance the <laughs> oh, okay. It's over. Sorry. Dance party's over. Stop. The one for babies. That is also my ringtone. <laughs> Oh, what? What? Odd twist there, okay. Did you answer it? Now you tell me, geez. A crank call then, followed by a murder. Your sister's messed up. Let's call me your sister at 518. Murder okay. going that 18. And hung up immediately. Well, I have heard this case is quite long, so there's probably quite a bit to unravel here. Dude, so this is what we're taking to court? What are we doing on time? Yeah, let's go to court. I feel, I feel like we need some court session. Oh yes, that's a good idea. <laughs> let's save over this. Okay. Making sure, because there's one time where I had a apparently did not, I failed to save and had to redo some stuff. So we got that as well. Trial former? I mean, why do you care? <laughs> Oh, I wasn't paying attention to the safe slot. Why is it called trial former? Mm-hmm. Well, you've kind of predetermined the outcome with with your strategy here. say they did it, right? You give me a little wink, wink, nudge, nudge here? Are you Mia-ing me, giving me advice? No. Uh, you're alive. Oh, and, and that. That's also. Oh, we're screwed. <laughs> Me 
you had a bigger personality. Yes, that's true. Oh, yeah, you're definitely screwed, Phoenix. You've requir he's required Faye assistance in every trial, right? In some form or fashion. Oh, hey, hey, Mia. Mm -hmm. Does that mean Emma's not helping either? Oh, good. Or she is. Is this allowed? You're not a paralegal. I mean, neither was Maya. All right, so replacing a spirit medium with a scientific investigator. Is that an upgrade, though? Okay. All right, courts and sash. Let's go. Hey, Judge, I missed you. I mean, then again, the prosecutor's job's pretty easy with, with the whole confession thing, pleading guilty. This should be pretty quick. Takes one to know one. So you're going to cheat, is what you're saying. I, th I thought it was in the judge's hands. Okay, good. We're skipping the whole pleading innocent or guilty thing. That's, that's a big win for us. What did you do, Emma? Prosecutor and executor. <gasps> Someone who does witnessing on a professional level. Amazing. A person only. Okay, I actually am getting really hungry, so if she keeps offering those lunch boxes, oh, this is going to be a rough one for me. <laughs> who, who calls her that? What is that? I, w I would try this. Oh, wait. Ca oh, caviar. Okay. No, not caviar. I've tried caviar exactly one time. Thought it was disgusting. Ho ho! Bribing me with caviar? No, see nothing wrong with this. <laughs> wolfing down caviar is. Okay, I'm intrigued by this one. Come on, man, that sounds pretty good. No, Edgeworth, I want to see the more food. Oh, he got some shit. This is... What even is this? Just a bunch of rice and some bird droppings? Or not bird droppings, but some kind of small animal droppings. Mouse droppings. Oh, 10 a.m. is not too early for lunch. Does it taste? <laughs> or I'm allergic, maybe. <laughs> okay, this is decreasing my appetite so far. <laughs> Thank you, Edgeworth.
No, you're hard to forget, ma'am. Lunchland. Is it also an amusement park, Lunchland? That seems like they could franchise it that way. And please describe this lunch land as well. What are the rides like? <laughs> or take a bathroom break during this court case, I think, the judge. Mm -hmm. uh, stabby Stabby is the description, Your Honor. Oh, okay. Hmm. How do you transition from that to lunch dispensing? I need a break. <laughs> I think the judge has already rendered his verdict in his head. Oh, that's... Okay. So, get a quick look. So there's the little wall thing. Got the chain links. Edgeworth's color. Okay, yeah, yeah. This all checks out. A block. There's four of them, right? All four of them. <laughs> Very small office for having like 12 plus floors in it. Hopefully they don't get more than five visitors at a time. Six visitors at a time. Seven. Very limited. <laughs> Went to drive the body? We never talked about that part. She doesn't have the authority to do that as a lunch person. <laughs> Starting off on a poor foot here. <laughs> yes, cough up queen. I, I mean, if you... All right, testimony time. Right. Which one? Oh. <laughs> okay, she does look pretty angry. A subtle burn on this was probably. <laughs> That's the party. <laughs> uh, what was the rest of what you said? Perhaps if we do some pressing. Uh -huh. Oh, 
Okay, don't go quoting Monty Python on me, Emma. That was way before your time. Oh, yeah! <laughs> she thinks crime is bad, so, yeah, I'm glad that's what Thank you. <laughs> and appreciate it. There's some unexplored backstory here. Lay oh, okay. Wait, Edgeworth fired her? No, that's different from a business sense. Like one, you may get a severance package at least. You're fortunate. to me. Yeah, fired so he didn't get to pay out that $20 annual bonus. That's the crux of this. Oh, the security guy. Yeah. <laughs> Does that mean I have a chance? Objection. <laughs> good, good on you, Joe. Sounds like bullshit. Hold it. Do you have medium training? Okay, I, 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 I can't relate to this. Yeah, thank you, Joe. When's the last time you guys saw a pumpkin chock full of seeds and how did it make you feel? That'll help me get immersed into this case better. She loves her lunch job way too much. Cheesy, all right, Judge. <laughs> That's not going to make our case look good. Uh. <laughs> it's, 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 it's
looks like a pretty normal looking car. It's just the redness of it is supposed to make it like sporty and stuff. I like how his knife is the same color as his clothes on the hand. Yeah, how'd she get it? Like, wouldn't that imply that she had his knife before, but wasn't it in his car? Alright, chat, I'm quiet. Indeed. Bullshit our way through this. <laughs> there is that. No, I'm just espousing your opinions. I mean, he is a rookie. Only four Ks. Which are no free lunches. Sounds delicious. <laughs> now I'm hungry again. <laughs> Case closed. Oh. Okay, this also looks bad. So, okay, A block, that I'm assuming is Edward's car, bloody coat. The moment you witnessed that. that looked like the moment after the crime. Or maybe that's what you mean. <laughs> what it is. A fresh camera, no less. Wow. Exciting. Yeah. Ooh, he's mad. That would help your case. a new one. <laughs> number four, number five. Uh, yes. I guess I can't question that. Oh. The moment of the crime. Fair question. Uh, well, she wasn't in the photograph. Do I object that? Press me. Yes, I'm for it. Pretty good. Are you gonna show a box with oh <laughs> Well there's a fence in the way. Hmm. 
Okay, so when did she get the camera? What is she claiming she took the picture? Oh no, we're looping. So I did miss an opportunity to do something. Probably. <laughs> okay. So, okay, where is the thing I had a suspicion I should? Okay, hang on. Hang on. Okay, what do I have? Reminder of what I have. Right. It's got to be about this. Okay, I'll, I'll get back to that in a second. Uh, yet. Okay, so she never photographed her holding the knife. That other picture we saw was an imagination picture, which is inadmissible. Let me take a closer. Yeah, no knife. I mean, yeah, the bloody coat's a bad look. It's important in these to separate the imagination pictures with the real. Ooh, what is that? Mmm. I don't see the salmon, though. I mean, the. Wait. Is the swirl a liquefied salmon? And it's just a bunch of rice? That doesn't sound that good. I want the actual, like, fish. It's really carby, though. It's, <laughs> see that much rice? Have to I did the Nickelback call out before. I have to resist doing it again. It's right there, though. <laughs> okay, good. I mean, she could have just been fumbling with her camera lunchbox. It does sound odd to, to use. Awkward. <coughs> Help me out here, man. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Objection. <laughs> Objection. Oh, my God. Dude. Ow. Not... Not cool. Hey, you're welcome for exonerating you, by the way, jerk. Yeah, it did strike me as kind of a weak objection. I mean, the coat, it's kind of a problem. She does look pretty calm. Oh, she's wearing gloves. Hmm, that's also bad. Potentially. Oh yeah, the knife, right. No prints on this. So. Mm. Objection! No, thanks Phoenix, you do my work for me. What the hell are Mario with objections? Objection, Mario. Blood spatter, what is this Dexter shit? Well, they're don't, not crimson, at least. But. Right. I mean, hard to say what else it could be. <laughs> oh, God. 
Apparently. <laughs> no problem. Stand up for yourself, man. Object. <laughs> yes, thank you. No problem, man. I'm a prosecutor now. Don't charm your way out of this with free lunches. I mean, what if you're like on a diet? You're trying to watch what you eat. That exacerbates the problem. Oh, you can do that? Yeah, write that down, Emma. Good lunch tech. Meditated, why his knife? This murder felt very improvised. I mean, the gloves are odd. Was it cold? It's February. Edgeworth, you're covering the photograph. Move. Or it's cold out, man. It makes people who wear gloves look bad. Anyone should ever put gloves, put on gloves and can only think of crime? It's pretty serious. Okay, so probably the fact that it is not her own knife is pretty odd. If you're coming in here, you, you'd have your own weapon with you, surely. I just, I just... I mean, of all the evidence, that's the only thing that possibly makes sense. Okay, wait. Yeah, not that. Just need to find the right statement to, to own... To own her. Uh, let's press first. They seem to give me some leeway if I miss an objection opportunity and loop back. Pretty consistent. Try to objection. Hmm. Maybe she wanted to do a murder and follow up autopsy for science. There's a lot of science in the family. That is true. February in LA is about 85 or so. Pretty warm. Based on the gloves alone. Now, if it's 85 Celsius, that would be, you would never, you would not wear gloves. And you'd be dead. This is it's gotta be the white Stop saying that, please. Uh, oh god, we're all the way back here. Okay. Okay, and where where did she say definitively the uh, Okay. 
Probably this one. Her credentials are sound. Yeah, I don't know what the 85 Celsius conversion is, but it, it sounds really unpleasant. I would not want to, like, be wearing gloves in that kind of weather. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, why she got to borrow a murder weapon if it's all premeditated? I'm gonna go commit a murder. Hopefully I find something to do it with. Yeah. What? Guys, guys, calm, calm. Slightly sus in this context, but you know. <gasps> yes. <gasps> oh. Can't lunch your way out of this one. <laughs> oh, she's losing her lunch now. As long as she doesn't testify <laughs> against herself. <laughs> okay, that's, that's actually kind of good, Edgeworth. Damn. But pie for lunch, though? Hmm. It's not trifling. Oh, they could, could they? Objection! I hate it when people mix that up. You need to uncover the lunch lady's true agenda. She's helping you out, man. Or he's helping you out. Lady, come on. Again, the super real honest truth testimony this time, if you please. Saw. So. Okay, the saw was in red. Does that mean visual aids are involved here? I do have the, uh, the, 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 um, this and, uh, and, uh, da, 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 da. since we're talking about what she saw, we have this photograph again, which might come up. Still wondering about the spatter, but, you know, fine. <laughs> I, I want this to come up somehow. Would you deduce, Angel? Or are you about to be boxed in? It's a lunch thing. Oh, 
I think you have a grudge against the chief boss. I'm really going with this robot metaphor thing. A bit. Yes. Okay, go with the press strats. And these desks are gonna break one of these days. There's been a lot of pressure put on them over the course of these five cases. Bacon stuff and put that in boxes too? She can do it all with lunch. <laughs> mm. I'm glad you didn't say that out loud. It's kind of weird. <laughs> the stabby actions. Sell full life. Isn't the former more important in this setting? Mm. Good thing that redial button only works on the last go. A letter? It's 2017, who writes letters? Chat, when's the rest of, last time you wrote a letter, a physical letter, not in a mail? Well, there was a phone there, but it did not work, we established earlier. Also, Lana did say that. Based on what? Fresh. And that's the camera one, right? A camera? Fresh camera. Ew. I, I, do, I do not like pretzels. Personal fact about me. So therefore, this testimony is baloney, which I do like more than pretzels. You do love pretzels? Get out of here. That's a ban. Ban for liking pretzels. I think they're gross. They're just... Ugh. Chat, press one if you love pretzels. Press two if you do not like pretzels. Press three if you are mediocre on pretzels. I want to get a scientific poll here. Seem to be kind of pro pretzel. All right, I guess we have to agree to disagree. Now we can do an official poll as well if you like. I've just never liked them. Now, what? How do you guys feel about stuffed pretzels, the bready pretzels? Those. Are an improvement. 
Yeah, combos. Or the like big, big ones you get at like parks and uh, amusement parks and stuff. Combo's pretty good. Yeah, the, the pizza ones that have like, not, well, those are like the baggy ones. We're talking about slightly different things, but I like those as well. I don't eat them particularly often. Back to the kids. Um, oh, I glossed over this. We, I wrote down. I wrote down. One stab. One stab. Which was in the, uh, the report, right? Yes. Clearly. Clearly it's Okay, writing things down is actually helping. When you guys played this for the first time, did you like have a separate little pen and paper thing to keep track of deets or did you just kind of wing it? In this stream setting, I feel like I need to write things down to appear competent. Yeah, the court record does kind of like give you everything you need. Ew. What? No. No, thank you. That looks gross. Mmm, moss. <laughs> Scary. Judge is checking his feet right now. Check your feet, Judge. Mm-hmm. Oh, thanks, Edgeworth. You're helping me. Again. Good check. <laughs> Poor fiddle. Ever second fiddle. <laughs> is this a crime scene lunch? What, what is that? Is a crime scene. But, but what is it? it? Did not look good. I would not eat whatever that was. Not blood? What is it then? Maybe she's a patron of those crime set lunches. There's only one step. Yeah, I'm getting confused. Character portrait? How do I? Oh, yeah, profiles. Now she is wearing something like that there. But not to see the crime. That is kind of weird. Four. <laughs> no, 
they don't. I mean, he has been eating a lot of caviar. He could use one. His beard must be filthy. Oh, we got a, we got a pretzel polo. Let's make it official. How people feel about pretzels. We got heart face, bar face, and neutral face. No one does not like pretzels, though. I'm kind of on the bar face train on that. I'm alone, I guess. I mean, this should all be dismissed at this point, yes. You're, you're losing track of things. <laughs> um, are we repeating? Oh, wait, did it? Yeah, we're looping. Oh, what did I miss? Oh, the red muffler thing? Uh, oh, the photograph again for the red muffler. That's gotta be it. Yeah, yeah. Um... Objection! Because she wasn't wearing it. Objection! Hey. Took me a bit, but we got there. Ah! How many lunchboxes has she dropped at this point? How many have been handed out, too? Like, the entire, uh... The entire room's been fed at this point. <laughs> Very good. Really, that means we've prevailed, though. At least one thing. And confessed also. Okay, so she was there, ran around to the, f oh, to the phone. Wait, quickly? But there's that fence in the way. Yeah, she parked in the, hang on. I need to look at this again. If she was over here, is my mouse? No, my mouse is not showing where I'm pointing. If she was in the B block, how'd she get past this giant fence that's in the way? to apprehend her in the first place. She would have had to leave, go all the way around the entire building. That doesn't make sense at all. Hmm. No way you quickly, Gara. That's true. Angels do have one. Also, how does citizens arrest stuff work in uh, Japan and Korea? Oh, muffler, double meaning muffler. Cause it's a parking lot. Mm.
by lunch. <laughs> Bitten by a stomach bug from my lunch that's like a cobra. How's the pretzel pole looking? Okay, a couple of people don't like pretzels. That's good. Good to know. I'm not alone after all. <laughs> Anyone else weak to that? So you tried to go up and arrest her while she was holding a bloody knife. Very brave. She probably had a knife-proof lunchbox vest to protect herself at the time. Oh, the oil drum, right. Mm -hmm. And they said it was filled with water, right? <laughs> but you saw one, Phoenix. You investigated that. You have very little imagination if you cannot conjure an oil drum in your head. Right. right. Um... The water bottle. Not the best hiding spot. Okay, is this where we show them? Hmm. Hold it! So we can get more info. Yeah, how did you get, how did you phase through the fence? Visitor. Part in the block. And you were a W circle in your W circle form at the time, right? That's 30 feet. Yes, yes. What? That went all the way to the ceiling, didn't it? That's not on the plan, but I thought in the room it looked like it covered everything. <laughs> yeah, show me the... Okay, it doesn't go all the way to the ceiling. Still, that's some effort. <laughs> you would have to have a mighty powerful lunch to gain that sort of athleticism. Now, wearing heels as well, pretty challenging. She did. <laughs> okay, the, the poll results are in. They're tied between neutral and loving pretzels. It's official. Okay, so clearly talking about a car muffler. That was the entire conversation. Muffler. Objection. So that was a different phone call, not the one to her sister. So this was a call before 518, as I've written down. Same and known for good memory. Okay, 
we did establish that phone was out of operation. So I hope you didn't need to have an emergency that day. Of course. I'm not pleased by any of this. Oh, so it was to Emma. So Emma did not hear that? Or is Emma holding back info? We need to go back to and look at those cars again. Oh, uh, let's try the phone. Hold it. Uh -huh. <laughs> the judge wants to be a defense attorney too. It's adorable. I call the judge a rookie too. Brave. Okay. Well, wait, you got a big old wall in the way. And wait, she did say that she saw her use this. I need to go back and look at the tape. Also, she probably mentioned it here too. Running, sure, but then this part, no way you could see her doing that. From there, at least. Why would she lie about where she was? Still can't see her. <laughs> okay, she instantly scaled the fence. Just one leap. Phoenix knows. Do I even need to object? some incredible leg strength assuming the drum was completely full of liquid that is true How did it not go? Other? oh that yeah She was standing there, she wouldn't have seen her coming, right? But if she did try to turn tail and run, yeah. Post arm grab. Oh yeah, yeah, because the drums were on the other side of the partition. This is a complicated, this is a like Looney Tunes-esque escape we're talking about. Yeah, yeah, here, here, here. Okay. Solid, yeah, solid all. That's pretty, pretty definitive. So, uh, um, 
guess I use this to object. There's nothing else that makes sense. Yeah. Objection! Yeah. You need to play some yakety sax over the escape sequence. Objection! Objection. Come on, Edgeworth, that's weak sauce. Which is probably in one of the lunchboxes. Well, there's the crutch. Do it, Phoenix. Your sweat. Okay, you're making me sweat. She is the queen of doing that. I mean, I'm more on the fence, clearing the fence thing than the seeing through the wall thing. I doubt her athleticism. It, true, one is more possible than the other. But they seem equally realistic. Oh, this is the really nailing her music. Looks like the coffin up queen's gonna be coughing up the truth soon. <laughs> I too have a lunch cough metaphor. To... Uh... Right. Um... Okay. We got the photo. We established Lana was there. So... Where she was, though. Oh, no. Seems like an angled pursue. Solid Bones, thank you for the raid! Where would she not be so? <laughs> There's too many objections. Wait, you're lying, Phoenix? Is that uh, Oh, do I have to pinpoint that? Oh, well, there's kind of only one, based on this diagram, there's kind of only one place, right? This place? Oh, do I need to drag? Because, yeah, I can't be here. Doesn't make sense. Doesn't make sense. Too visible. Yeah, you got me. Take that! Oh, okay. She has a boyfriend. She has an inn. To that room, with her romantic partner, one of a dozen. I mean, I can't really tell that from here, but sure. No. -uh. Yeah, so 
So wait, she parked in B, went all the way around the build, or maybe visited her boyfriend at post parking. Oh. Well, that would also explain how she got to her so fast. I think. As the security room, or is that door that was locked before? It was locked before. Uh, VT Kipster, thanks for the raid. Welcome, everyone. Planes, uh, first time Phoenix Wright playthrough, case five. Delighted about it. No, Angel Star, I got to go to her, Coffee Queen. I just had quite a. I appreciate the race, but we got to have courtroom decorum, okay? Her lunch career has corrupted her morality. position to take that picture though if she was in the security room how's the timeline's all weird Objection. oh yeah she's going to jail <laughs> Wait, that's my job? Emma, help. Okay. Right. kind of established angle lighting I mean she's closer <laughs> that eliminates the hopping the fence things sure Objection. does Edgeworth have the best objection voice I think he does or no Von Karma does can never forget his objection but like second best it's a top tier objection sound. Better than Phoenix's. All right. How do you get from the security room to down here though? Is there like a little stairwell right next to it with this door here? Objection. See his objection just sounds kind of whiny. Yeah. You said she got there pretty fast. Yeah. We catch her a lie here. Yeah. Would you, does, is this good? Do you guys think this is good? My initial reaction's revulsion, but I do like fried calamari. 
it does kind of look like a bunch of rubber bands on rice. Maybe that's where I was like, oh, you know. Hey, Chad, small feet eat rubber bands and rice. A PB and J line? After everything that you've presented, this sounds kind of basic. Oh, boysenberry jam, though. Boysenberry for the boyfriend. That makes sense thematically. Yeah. Thanks, Joe. Oh, okay. When we were in the uh, parking lot earlier... I don't know if it's relevant now, but that door was locked. But I don't know if it was locked from that side. Oh, okay. I thought she was going to lie and, like, that was going to be relevant. So, wait. But how'd you... That's a long way to get there fast. And then scale them. You had to be exhausted by the time you apprehended her, then. right, Judge? Yeah. That is not fast at all. That's a long time for things to happen, and you had. Although this, I can't see the stairs and stuff. Yeah, I can. Like that's a long time to not see what's going on here. That's for five minutes. Why would she? Yeah, why would she be lingering there for five minutes post-murder? Nothing makes sense here. It's a bunch of baloney. That's a long time! That's almost like six minutes. Okay, but so she was there five minutes later, though, if she got to that vantage point to take the shot, the camera. So now I don't know what to believe. <laughs> Plastic sporks, those are a dime a dozen. <laughs> How do you guys judge the invention of the spork? Wonderful? Like, how often do you guys use sporks? I don't think they're that impressive. Nah, the caviar lunch doesn't look that good. Oh my god, you're gonna eat all that a second time, dude? Uh, I mean, usually in these situations, this is the uh, correct option. That time gap is too substantial, though. Right, yeah. What's that? Is this true? I've not made pasta in a long time. Oh, if you like it al dente. Is this accurate? Any chefs care to comment? Okay, it adds up. Okay. Oh, you're told to cook it eight to 10 minutes before straining. So there's, there's hmm, some contradiction here. That's the camera box again, though, right? Yeah. Strange. Chill, big chill. I mean, we've done that a number of times. I mean, hey. Okay, so she was, in fact, lingering, and that's odd. So what, but why? Dowdled. <laughs> Maybe 
Things are even more confusing now after day one. This is the long case, right? So we got quite a bit to go. We have another witness? It's not Sheriff Marshall, is it? Of lunches. There is the matter of who actually did it. That's maybe important. I am now the cough up queen. Oh, okay. Well, um, wait. Oh, uh, lunch off. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, we if we were eating lunch too. Good. Oh, the trump card. <laughs> How many lunch boxes has she unveiled so far? I have not counted or dropped. Whoa, that's a lot of food. <laughs> that looks more like a quadruple deck. Judge clearly has a pro lunch bias, as do we all, I guess. Uh, what you got? Huh? No. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Hang on. Huh? I guess that can be the. Thing. No, no, the shoe is just out of nowhere. You didn't lead with this? Uh. Uh, objection, advertising your business during your testimony. Even though we're supposed to be on the same side. How? It, a boyfriend. Three, four. I see. And they all know? This is getting complicated. Quite a player, yeah. That was an awkward work setting, though, if they don't know. Or if they do. When has this mattered in this world at all? There's only two, though? Wall books must be really short, if you can fit it all in these uh, kind of text boxes of this size. Shall be shown without the approval of. Interesting. I don't know. <laughs> it seems so. I mean, we have established Phoenix doesn't read.
<laughs> How often have we broken this evidence law already in these five cases? So if you needed to get in, infiltrate the forensics department so bad, why three boyfriends there? I guess she wants to have fun too, as well as get the forensics. This timetable is very unrealistic. Okay. This sounds made up. Oh! It's only two sentences. You couldn't even study that, Phoenix. Yeah, Edgeworth just got the updated autopsy treatment. Now he knows how it feels. Sure. Huh. The traces of blood from Goodman is fine. Hmm. This, this trial's lasting a while. Um. Okay. Out of curiosity, how close am I to the conclusion of this segment? Because I do need to wrap up soonish. There's a clean stopping point. That would be good. Oh, half an hour? Oh my god. What if I have that much time? May have to do an awkward uh, end point here. Figure it out. Oh, I am near the end? It's all the lunch. It's just made me famished. Well, the prosecution's trying to help you, lady. Of all? How testimony works. You withhold everything until you absolutely need it. Classic evidence law. Well, and the triple boyfriend. Well, we couldn't see in the photo if it wasn't really clear enough to determine if there's... I mean, her shoes look clean there. I don't see anything out of sorts. Yeah, the color mismatch too, but I could chop that up to weird color photography stuff. I don't know. Well, it's 
she did the ball test. Here with science. Phoenix learning about forensics in a live in the courtroom zone. Fortunately, I haven't nailed down a boyfriend in the DNA department yet. Afraid he's gonna say something sensible like that. Um. Okay, I haven't actually looked at the shoe. We. Oh right, the uh, the flippy flip stuff. One on the bottom as well. You could do a blood test just by looking at it. Wow. Oh yeah, her vanity. That would explain that. She said it was had happened in a tragic murder accident. And what about the bottom we saw there? Ah! Okay, but the floor looked pretty clean. In the in the photo. And we were there when we were actually there, there were no like clear stains, I don't think. Uh, can I can I just object with it? wrong <laughs> maybe do that prematurely okay or I'm just getting really hungry getting impatient that's fine doesn't look like there's any pepper on those though pepper fish guts who's in Phoenix is in. Oh, they're hot fish nuts. Mm, watery soup. single gut or the whole thing <laughs> well how long has it been sitting there though it can't be that hot uh oh do i go back to the thing yeah the this i guess because the floor looks fine A judge, objection, threatening, witness. that or blue badger yeah 
Yes, thank you. Music and everything. Yeah. Oh yeah, this was post-murder, supposedly. Clearly. Oh wait, where's the tipped over oil drum? There's only one... Or is this... I guess that's two drums. It just kind of looks like one. So that's just... That was pre-knocking over. Tennis match here of objections. Oh yeah, also. Oh yeah, it was full of water. But we don't know how it tipped over, do we? Just the claim that uh, Lana kicked it. <laughs> I give up. Huh? Hmm? Do a little telepathy. And Edra's gonna bail me out again? was blood on the floor, but all washed away. Literally no trace at all. And a leopard woman, too. Also. She's a leopard woman robot killing machine. Well, sometimes you just gotta kick over an oil drum. very heavy. What's that? Edgeworth has his own court record he's helping me with. Slip and slide, that's fun. her blood. Plus, I want a third helping of that caviar. Let's get it. Oh, um... Science?
the judge just pulls a 180. I don't know. I don't want the corn and the beans. <laughs> I still don't have any lunch boxes in the court record, correct? No. Wait, the, you got dethroned though. The judge made that official. Enough. <laughs> Stop submitting evidence in the last minute. Another one? It's. Well, I just got stabbed. Uh, my chill out post being dead. He does look really, really relaxed. It looks like a comfortable trunk. Can't keep. She can't keep getting away with this. to double click on that. Is it in the record yet? Not official yet? No. Wait, wait, let me look at it. Oh, thank you. Well, the, your text box is kind of in the way. I need to... It is? I just... Oh. Okay, yes. Um... But wait, he was already wait, dead. And then... I need another look at that photograph. <laughs> I guess Phoenix doesn't care to get another look at the photograph. I knew I couldn't win from the beginning. Oh, bad. Sure. Yeah, that's true. We're just doing our solid. Right, the power went up soon. Was it time for intervention beyond the grave? So Mia's on parking lot metaphors. We've got lunch metaphors and sheriff marshal gun metaphors. Now hold the front door, Joe. That was Phoenix, right? Okay. That was Phoenix, right, right? <laughs> I just want to get out of here. Again, have to resist. You're, you're blocking the photograph, Phoenix. Get your giant face out of there. That's the un little known part of evidence law. They don't tell you. They don't teach you. Well, if you'd let me look at it, yes. The problem... I guess we'll look at your evidence. Justice, whatever. Okay. Okay, the problem. Oh, the shoe is bloody. I thought the shoe was clean. At the first look, but no, the blood is on it. So. Oh, a oh, muffler, muffler. Oh, there's something in there. Else weird. Shoes fine. 
Socks are very clean. That is the only... Take that! What is in there? Just some cloth? Paper? Wet paper? <laughs> Judge, you have to know there are other meanings of this. Can't believe I'm having to say this, Your Honor. Edgeworth, car expert. Yeah, Judge Piv. Wow, I learned something today. This changes my understanding of cars forever. Oh, it is cloth, okay. Well, in the context of that phone call seems important. Is it still there? Can we go back and look? Pull it out? Objection! That's right. You don't even need to present something. You've got your own words to use against you. Uh, the phone. Yeah. <laughs> Thankfully, it says muffler right there. So I know it's right. Remember this from like minutes ago? Hours ago? Damn English language having words mean the same thing for different things. <laughs> Woohoo! Org! <laughs> Cowboy guy. He kind of weirds me out. Oh. We've never done that. I need to wipe my beard with it. I have caviar all over it. Cloth would help. I suppose so. God, we've been going four hours? Oh my goodness, we have. <laughs> we got to wrap it up. Sounds like we are, though. Oh my god, only 30 minutes? We have to come back? Fourth helping of caviar. Yeah, this has all been one day. Good. 